Welcome to the next video on VAT. This time we're going to discuss how to go about charging VAT. Meet Ben. He is very excited. He's landed himself with a nice contract of £5,000 plus VAT per month. He prepares his first invoice in his accounting software and it tells him to charge his customer £6,000. Ben is confused. Why is he invoicing his customer £6,000 when he's only billing them £5,000? Does that mean he'll be getting paid £6,000 or £5,000 into his bank? If the former, what should he do with the extra £1,000? Here's how it works. Ben will add 20% to the value of his sales invoice for VAT. His customer will pay him the VAT inclusive amount, in this case £6,000, and then Ben will need to hold on to that £1,000 of VAT until his next VAT return. And on his next VAT return, he will pay the VAT is collected from his customers less any VAT suffered on his purchase over to HMRC. Just to wrap up for summary, VAT is charged as an additional 20% on your sales invoices. You must hold on to the VAT collected and be ready to pay it over to HMRC on your next VAT return. A business can recover the VAT suffered on its purchases against the VAT collected from its sales. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. Please look out for the next video in the series. Thanks for watching.